feeling if you are just joining us on the show you are watching the latest breakfast show here in this hair town you can find us at white on facebook y254 channel on twitter white254 underscore channel on the gram hashtag is y in the morning so we are asking you a question on your socials on our socials eh? How now? <laughs> I must jump up. I think Naskianja, guys. In fact, I've been thinking about Smoky Pasua for, I think, almost 15 minutes. And I can't wait. I can't wait. But it is what it is. So, Abu, let us know. Hashtag is why in the morning. So, it's time for that conversation. And, and if, in case you missed the, the previous <laughs> interview, it was due to public demand. Like, it's just that you wanted to watch it again and again and again. And don't be afraid to ask for more. But you can also find us at Y254 channel on YouTube in case the itch is a bit too, you know, insistent. Now, let me allow my panelists to introduce themselves to you. Yeah. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How are you feeling? I'm good. You guys look good. Okay, maybe start with the ladies. How are you? I like your hair. Thank you. Okay. So Please introduce yourself to um, the my people. Name is Fiona. Mm -hmm. I'm currently working in KBC. Mm -hmm. All right, what do you do? I'm a journalism student. Oh, yeah. look at you. Do you want to report or, or just report? Yeah? Yeah. You have the car, the poster, eh? Yeah. We'll be mine up for hashtag is why it's funny. What is your name, kind sir? Uh, my name is uh, Evangelist Mutinda Charles mm -hmm. Runo. Mm -hmm. I am an international husband. Yeah, about that. Please help me understand what that means exactly. It means I'm married to a beautiful Tanzanian lady uh -huh. by the name Koko. Uh, wait, ooh, ooh. Yes. she even has swag in her name. Uh, Koko, we are Koku. sorry. All right. Yes. So why international husband? Is it because we live in Kaboda? Uh, hmm. One, it's, it's about identity. Mm -hmm. It's about uh, creating yourself in the universe. Mm -hmm. How do you want to be recognized? Mm -hmm. How do you want to be known? Mm -hmm. And uh, since I relate with matters, relationships, marriage, mm -hmm. and and family matters, mm -hmm. it comes on board very handy. It's also it also means maybe nilikosa loko, so I head to Vuka border. <laughs> I'm a father of two. <laughs> it's okay. We'll forgive you because you are a very proud father and husband. We'll forgive you. It's, it's okay. We'll thank you. you. Thank you. Yeah. So yes. uh, our topic of the day, if you did not know, let me tell you, to know, Lisa, it, do shows and programs that you watch on TV or elsewhere, do they affect how you act, think, and behave? Do, do they? Do they affect you? And I would like to assume that, I'm not assuming it's the truth, but let me just pretend I'm assuming. I would like to assume that this is because of the recent um, murders we've been hearing at Kwanzaa and Karura and, and how someone randomly watched Killing Eve and read two books and decided it's time. It is time. Hashtag is one in the morning. So what do you think? What do you think, guys? Feel free <coughs> to jump in at any moment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, personally, I don't, it's not even thinking. Mm -hmm. Whatever we read, whatever we watch, mm -hmm. it actually affects how we react, mm -hmm. how we reason, how we think. It gives us a worldview. Yani tukuna vile tukio na kitu flani. Kuna vile tu behavior yako lazima tu itaenda na hiyo kitu at a certain perspective. Hmm. And especially in the current generation kwa sasa we view so much. Actually we read less mm -hmm. and view more. Mm -hmm. That's why we have is it talk TikTok something. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, maybe, and as a Jew, as I do, uh, the current generation. You see, this, 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 this thing you just, I, I, I downloaded, I, uh -huh. I, I looked, and it was just looking. Uh -huh. the, the, the you can waste hours. I'm telling hey. you, uh, just hey. watching, moving from one another to, to another, another, moving from suggested another. Suggested for you. Uh, hey. And this one, mm -hmm. uh, And you're just <laughs> watching, and as you said, consuming hours and hours and hours. Uh, it really affects, mm -hmm. direct. Uh, when you come to reading, uh, it's also another source of, like, uh, a worldview that gives you, like, uh, unafanya vitu kwa sabu meso makitu flani. Mm -hmm. I, I'll be sharing what our, our reading has affected me, actually. Uh, but when you look at the current generation, mm -hmm. if you write somebody a paragraph, mm -hmm. they will not read. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Just short, 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 short. Uh, I, I mean, in so many WhatsApp groups, and you find sometimes when you are writing something long, you mm -hmm. get few responses. But we can take a two bit of fupi fupi. So it means people are reading. But the reading trend has changed. Is it the capacity? Our capacity has become smaller. Um, uh, we just don't want. Yeah, <coughs> yeah, yeah. I, uh, that is one. But uh, but again, you see, we 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 are generation in takavitu zaraka raka. Not takavitu faster, faster. Not takavitu. Umalize ufanye hi do them at the same time. Ah, uh, yano unataka watch, unataka read, unataka kuko social media, unataka ngi kwa WhatsApp, unataka ufanye hivi. So you find if you find anything time consuming, I don't know last time we kwa public means or kapata msa me banovo ni when. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, yes, there is this trend kwamba tunasoma kwa tunasoma kwa, kwa simu, mm -hmm. but I cannot tell you very few are able to do that because of these interactions of like uh, WhatsApp, uh, something kwa Facebook, yo TikTok imetokea nini. Mm -hmm. So reading we are reading, mm -hmm. but the changing the trend is different. Mm -hmm. But they do affect us. What do you think, Fiona? Do you think um, they affect us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. To add up to what you're saying, mm -hmm. like let's say for example, um, personally, I don't like reading. Like if you send me a long text, mm -hmm. <laughs> read the first two lines and then I give up it's on that. Yes. <laughs> Why do I have to struggle? And you can maybe call someone and we talk one on one and finish that conversation. Uh -huh. yeah, so reading also affects our behavior. Mm -hmm. Plus watching also. Like um, for example, I once watch this movie um what men want mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. as i'm walking I'm like, what do the men want like, i feel like i, I can read them you read them you can read them my research yeah, yeah. What they want what the men want so when i'm walking i'm concentrating on men looking at men like and then I remember it was just a movie. <laughs> so what I'm saying, go there. Unaza kufikiria na umse na taka ni ni. Unaza kufikiria umse. Unaza kufikiria umse. Unaza kufikiria umse. Unaza kufikiria umse. Why you look at me like that? Yeah. Excuse me. Yeah. So when you walk and you see someone looking at you like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like you can read their mind. Yeah, so watching in effect, like, sometimes when a movie, unaza watch, it can impact what you will do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so... I, I have a question. What's the, what's the difference between um, having a, a passion for reading? Because honestly, this one of the ongoing cases, mm -hmm. it's not concluded, so we can't say okay. fact. Yeah, yeah. So on one of the ongoing cases, he not only watched Killing Eve, but he also read Red two book. books. Yes. yes. So is it that? Uh, <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I'm one of those people, and this is a bit weird, I've always been a geek, I'm, I'm one of those people who prefer the book to the movie. If, mm -hmm. if the movie is out, I'll first find the book, mm -hmm. Kwanzaa. Mm -hmm. eh, mm -hmm. I'm a, I'm a, no, no, ni watch movie Kwanzaa, and then now I, I consume yeah, yeah. the book mm -hmm. Vizuri Sasa, yeah. let me mm -hmm. just, my imagination is out there. Yeah. So I'm, I'm assuming now this, this one has not only watched, and he's also gone back, I'm even highlight. assuming, Kuna Mali alikuwa na highlight. An highlight, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Uh -huh. Ati, he did what? Ati, how did he get away with it? Allah uh -huh. sabu, according to uh, Kenyan industry, how yes. he's going to get away with it. Uh -huh. I'm sure that you kusema when you're at the Nairobi Bank, ni money heist. Like, uh -huh. money papel, heist. Eh? They saw that Nairobi. Eh? Nairobi. <laughs> Nairobi. <laughs> Yeah. Is it that, is it that entertainment has now become a threat? Um, uh, can we not distill information? Uh, I, I still take many kijana, mm -hmm. and we are, we have a, a kijana generation. Mm -hmm. uh, let, let me share a little bit of how reading affected me. Mm -hmm. I, I think I was I, I was a teenager or a young boy at the age uh, in class seven, somewhere eight. Mm -hmm. So we are talking about nineties, mm -hmm. and I'm sure you are not there. Mm -hmm. uh, <coughs> it's okay. Uh, you're young. You look young. So maybe. So you can imagine at class seven, uh, I read a book by. Uh, is it John Grisham? It's mm -hmm. called The Partner. The lawyer guy. Yes, mm -hmm. The Partner. And uh, this book, it had a detailed, oh, a guy ran away from home, mm -hmm. he was married, he, he, he was a farm, uh, he was a lawyer in a, fat, in, in, a, in a farm, and somehow things were not working for him, a career-wise wanted to and somehow he, he, he plotted mm -hmm. how to run away from his family, and uh, 
Okay, that was so that's something I read. Ten, ten, so ten, for details, Uneza, Uneza from your kitab. But I actually implemented it. Ah, uh, yeah. I, I, uh, th this has to do more with parenting, mm -hmm. uh, how how you raise your kids, mm -hmm. and uh, what the things they go through. Mm -hmm. So uh, I've been raised up by a very good mom, mm -hmm. uh, but a general, <laughs> very strict. <laughs> you you know those parents of those days, eh? Confirm, eh? they can eh? just. <laughs> Take you to the next level. So uh, my my upbringing was a, a little bit over strict, mm -hmm. and my mom was very harsh. Mm -hmm. And uh, I used to go through phases of emotional detachment, suffering. Uh, I felt lost. Mm -hmm. Outside, you could meet me. I was a very happy guy. I mm -hmm. was born again mm -hmm. uh, when I was in class six. I was I, I was preaching. I was doing a lot of things in the church. I was, you know, but because of the the fire at home. Mm -hmm. I was hurting in the inside mm. and I had nobody I could talk to and share with but because of love for books mm. I used to read a lot I'm the guy used to read at with that with that nanny back then oh. don't ask what guy on a rusua kifika 10 off mm. <laughs> <laughs> we have seen them. Mm. <laughs> so, so I, I used to read a lot. I, I read Akina James Ali Chase, Akina Nancy Drew, all those kinds of novels. <laughs> but this one, Hardy this one boys. stood out, out different. Uh -huh. So I was, I was, what am I going through? How could I escape this? Mm -hmm. uh, of course, suicide was somewhat thinking, but was not an option. Mm -hmm. And then I, I felt like I need to run away from this home. I, I, I can't keep on staying here. It's getting more every time. Actually, I used to fast and pray about it. I love Nikki Maliza to fast TV. Papa. It gets fiery. Boy. So you can imagine I used to cry a lot. Mm -hmm. My be I used to have my own room and I used to cry a lot during the night. Mm -hmm. I used to cry my pillows. Just, But but during the day, mm -hmm. I was okay. I was this good guy. Um, so one day, one time, I decided to hatch a plot run away from home. Mm -hmm. And that's what I did. Uh, when I joined Form 1, mm -hmm. it's a long story, I'm just jumping up. Uh, when I joined Form 1, our school got banned, so I had to, uh, it, was a, it was a provincial school, so I had to come home. F and uh, my parents gave me an option of a day school, which was nearer. Mm -hmm. So I was leaving and uh, cycling to school day mm -hmm. in the morning and the evening. So now, being closer to mom, it was another big challenge. Oh, yeah. So... Mm -hmm. <laughs> You, you can imagine, um, uh, I'll not give you the details, but you, you can imagine as a kid, mm -hmm. as a teenager, you're going through this stuff. And then I just joined a new school, and then uh, there was this Kijana. Yeah, let me tell you, bullying is very bad. Mm -hmm. This guy used to call me uh, Jackie No No. Oh. And I used to hate it. And uh, it was a form three or form four there. So you can imagine at home things mm -hmm. are not working. Mm -hmm. At school, things are working, mm. that are not working again, so my performance is also dropping. In the society, I look good. Mm -hmm. People are just appreciating and loving me. Mm -hmm. I wasn't a bad boy, I think so. Mm -hmm. But mm. Uh, let me tell you, when it is a mwisho, a mwisho, I decided I want to run. I just wanted to implement. So this guy used to do a lot of things which could not, like Ali Yachilia. Akakuwa na madevu, akakuwa mnene, akakuwa na, yani ataka ile careless free too, akapigia mapicha mingi. So when this guy disappeared, eh, he went to marathon daily. Aka nyo, aka nini, aka, so he changed his lifestyle. Mm -hmm. So what did I do? Uh -huh. uh, okay, wow. I didn't do that far at all. <laughs> But I, I, I used to think I want to go to Dar es Salaam, mm -hmm. Tanzania. Ah, and no, I, I, I finally <laughs> bought a baby. It's all making sense. Continue. Uh -huh. So what did I do? I, I, I decided in my conversations with anyone, I hated TZ. Mm -hmm. I hated Tanzania. Okay, Kwetu, Kwetu ni Taveta. Mm -hmm. Border. Mm -hmm. We are border. Taveta in Tanzania. Ta, ta Kenya in Tanzania. Olili border. I'm a Taveta border. So... We used to have market days. Mm -hmm. So there, there was a lot of interaction. Mm -hmm. So for me, I used to just look vile. I hate these guys. I don't love them. Reason was like the day I disappear, nobody should ever think Mutinda na Izenda. <laughs> So I was just to put your back story. Uh -huh. Yes, I was just implementing what I had learned from this guy and I did it for several months. I just hated TZ and I just like me upenda na Robi. Mazile siko tapata me tazai shi na Robi. Long term. Long term plan. <laughs> so eventually the day of disappearing came. Uh -huh. I went to the market. Uh I think we were in mid term so I went to the market. Uh and uh, I I I I I I left mom. Mm -hmm. I ran back home. Mm -hmm. 
na nikachukua gunia unaona hii gunia nikachukua mango zangu na nini na nini na eh nikaka kwa gunia you know i need to look like a market guy ambaye anatoka camouflage I'm telling you that's what I did. Uh-huh. Uh, so even when I was crossing the border no papers nothing mm-hmm. umsa ametoka sokoni. So you, you can see mm-hmm. sokoni na kwa Wednesday and Saturday. Mm-hmm. So I I di- I couldn't uh, escape on a Tuesday or on a, oh, on a Thursday. So <laughs> that was planning. And remember now I've just from 2 uh, I'm 16 uh, 16 or 15. So I've just joined from 2. Uh-huh. But ni kitu nilisoma nikikuwa class 7. Wow. Few years back uh-huh. and I'm implementing it now. So mimi nikachukua kabagana nikangwa kwa hivi. Ni asa kiniona tu mseme toka sokoni anatoka anavuka the other side nikavuka boda ya kwanza nikavuka boda ya pili. Mm-hmm. Alafu nikaingia nikaenda mpaka Arusha. So kuingia kwa Arusha na kutafuta place nikabadilisha mm-hmm. na nikachukua zile nguo nikaeka kwa bag. Wewe. Mm. And remember this time I did not have money so I had stolen my parents money uh-huh. that was my my ticket. And uh, nikafanya nini? Nikaingia kwa gari. I, I paid the bus to Jerusalem but I slept. Walikupitisha kwa bus. Hapana nilala tu kwa bus. Mm. And then the following day Dar es Salaam. No, to, to 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 just summarize that when my parents and uh, okay of course I had written a, I I had written a note uh, what I've done uh, and yeah. the reason <laughs> but let me tell you <laughs> what, what let me tell you <laughs> what happened <laughs> later when I'm told the stories mm-hmm. okay I came back later it's another long story uh-huh. I'm told they searched everywhere mm-hmm. but not Tanzania mm-hmm. Everybody was like tutafute watu wetu wako Nairobi tutafute wako Mombasa uh, uh, mutinda is uh, mutinda is missing they did everything they could mm-hmm. but not at given time did they ever think umtinda vile alikuwa anachukia wa Tanzania kweli anaweza kwa alivuka border so that was uh-huh. if if i just made okay, it okay. if you know it, it, can i just use his story to ask a question yes. you see where he's coming from is is okay a lot of dramatics yes but you know in his head at the time you sound like you you were making sense to yourself like you you need escape you need to be free yeah. and all these things but basically he kufanya kenya lisoma ama kenya li watch it's coming from kenya li kwa na feel mm-hmm. But we in a generation nime, there's just the other day we have a conversation here to sema ati oh, I'm asking my panelists and like, eh nowadays people are committing suicide mm. decide they're doing what then they like, no kwani us we didn't go through things I'm like no <laughs> now you can't tell someone like that just so kumwambia hivyo see see to do that by themselves how do we how do we figure out what the problem is before it escalates like how do we know kama watu wa society jo kimi sisters are not a parent mm-hmm. so how can we tell mm. <laughs> it's a hard question hey, hey. Look, maybe we ask him did you behave differently just <laughs> before just before you you ran away or you planned this whole thing uh, I, i'll tell you where the problem is mm-hmm. and so where, where, when you know where the problem is mm-hmm. you'll find the solution mm-hmm. uh, and uh, we like you we pick the guys the guy he he, he, he masked our family mm-hmm. he had issues with the family mm-hmm. and uh, when you read because it's what we are reading mm-hmm. they look like a good family mm-hmm. uh well catered for the guys in in, in campus so you, you can imagine they, they they must be living good but let me tell you is is we are growing up mm. we have emotions we mm. have feelings we mm. have disappointments we have challenges and uh, one of the things is a pillar that can help to navigate through the pillar ya mzazi mm-hmm. parenting and uh, and uh, one of the things that uh, because it is the real it is the reality according to the story the guy alikuwa na hate wazazi and because walikuwa na one layout to wengine something like that so he had inside him it was not outside it was inside him mm-hmm. that he had these battles yeah but even in the news they said he was a very calm guy he was always by himself mm-hmm. that's why it's, that's the people who keep it inside is yes it? that's why it's inside inside uh-huh. inside uh, and one of the things that i like to challenge parents mm-hmm. is to learn to affirm their kids mm-hmm affirmation mm-hmm. it, it is one of the solutions it's 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 not everything mm-hmm. but it helps it helps when you affirm your kid it, it doesn't matter whether the kid is good or is not good it doesn't matter amefanya vizuri amejafanya vizuri but affirm you are my son 
Uh, okay, the other things, create time with them, listen to them, talk to them. But I want to talk with affirmation in this. Uh, let me bring the, the biblical perspective of it. We are seeing Jesus is, uh, is born again. Uh, not born again, he's born, uh, he's born, and then 30 years, he's just about to start his mission. Mm -hmm. And then we see, his, he, we see uh, the heaven opening and God saying, this is my son whom I love. He had done nothing. Uh -huh. Nothing. Akwa mifanya kitu. Lakini to God aka farm. Uni mtoto wangu ni naempenda. Later, in the journey, there was another affirmation. Amefanya fanya, it was towards the, the config, in, uh, is it configuration somewhere there? Tuliona tena, heaven na funguka na hafu, God tena naongea. This is my son, whom I love. Mm -hmm. Now, when you bring it into parenting perspective, do not wait for this son to do something. Mm -hmm. Do not wait for this girl to do something. Can you be affirming them as they are? Okay, but with respect, parents are out here losing jobs because of COVID-19 and maybe they're going through their own things. And again, I'm not a parent, yes. but we must also understand their headspace. Perhaps, and we are living in an African, you know, culture. We don't have time for I love you, I love you. you I, 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 I did not say you. I love you. I did not say I love you. Uh -huh. Affirmation. If, if I, I talk about affirmation, it's not necessarily just saying I love you. Mm -hmm. it, because when you put in the African culture, but there's something you can do for your kid. You can, they can tell my parent love me. Mm -hmm. I love mm -hmm. hugging my kids. Mm -hmm. I love just hugging them. Just, you know, like, like ah, hugging, even without talking to them. Anajua. He still work for us because, as as we know it, people there are some parents who are just basic. Where they have put food on the table, I've educated, yeah. I've educated you. That's tembe na yesu. And then when you reach a certain age, you you, you stretch yeah. your wings and you fly. You fly. And then you go. You. Yeah, and then I say, good job. I might raise someone who can at least stand on their own two feet. Allow me to say this. Mm -hmm. Changing times. Mm -hmm calls for modernization in parenting. Mm -hmm. uh, tuko kwa e generation tuko sai na tuwezi kata na tuwezi hepa. This is, if you want to, to mention, if you are a parent, ambia mtu toko wafanya kitu, alafu, just kwa text, mtumie, ama WhatsApp. Sasa, fanya hivi. Mm -hmm. which, which works faster? Mm -hmm. Which one which, which one comes home? Use the social media mm -hmm. or use the uh, way. You know, you know that authoritative and uh, and then check the responses. You find that's what I'm saying. It's modern parenting, mm -hmm. and one of the pillars. It's it's not everything. It's one of the pillars. It's parenting to jaribu ko, ko realize our as you said. It's COVID. It has struck us. Mm -hmm. Things are working against us as parents. Mm -hmm. Remember also this kid. They have their world. They have their own world. You also have to step up mm -hmm. and know how do you fit in as a parent. Mm -hmm. How do you create time to know? Ndiyo, because of whatever you are doing, peer in our effect. Mm -hmm. How do you reach out to them? Because tunasema, kukuwa na shida, what is the solution? Solution yetu tunasema, as a parent, step up your game in parenting. Mm -hmm. Also watch these movies and say, to see nini wanaona, mm -hmm. ama ninini inafanyika. You, you also need to know, okay, uh, um, I watch movies, I watch series. Okay. It affects me uh -huh. as a person. I know my thinking, I know my talking, but what do I watch? All right, so, so let's do this. Let's go to the audience and let's see what they are saying. So it's at White Platform on Facebook, Y254 channel on Twitter. Hashtag is Y in the morning. I hope you're, you're feeling something. Are you feeling something? Because he's v speaking very passionately and Sanjay here and I, <laughs> Ati Fiona and I are just learning things. Okay, all right. So we have one, Somi Shanal, that says hashtag Y in the morning. I don't think so because everyone has a brain to decide what is good and what is not good. TV programs should not define your character if you've just joined in we're asking do you think the things that we read and watch affect our behavior what we do how we think uh who and what he says no okay imagine james says kwanza meanzia maria maria series vile inonyesha jinsi watoto wanapora mali za wazazi kuafukuza kwa nyumba zao na kuji kwa dadilisha kwa watu acting industry in kenya is a mess because they're always after the money and not thinking about more negative sides yani you're going to can I have a... Oh, excuse you? What? 
Mbono usumbuya kina le casa de papel. Why are you not stressing the, the killing of people? Why, 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 how, how, how are you placing that blame at home? Sai, kwa zandu tumengia Netflix. Yeah. Hey, sai, maze, Netflix ikona iko. Swahili eh? subtitles. And yes. you're going to say like that. <laughs> why, why? No. I disagree with that uh -uh. comment. Atavimi. Huh. Yeah. Feliz, Feliz says no. Jenkins Mwangi says yes, it does affect. Maggie's Angel says somehow yes, but kuna zingine they don't influence how the society behaves. Okay. Uncle Dennis Can says... Can I interact with that? Sure. Dog, allow me. Mm -hmm. These things, they are created by people like us, mm -hmm. they sit down, they imagine, mm -hmm. they write down. Mm -hmm. So they look at what is ha happening in the society. Mm -hmm. uh, they, they can't give us, like now, this Your show, charger, it's mm -hmm. about what is happening in the society. Mm -hmm. You can't give people what is not affecting them. Mm -hmm. So they are being influenced by the happenings in the society. Mm -hmm. So we must consider whether negative, whether positive, whatever that we are consuming through our tellies, it's what is happening in the society. Mm -hmm. We need to be, we, we can't run away from that. It's a fact. Mm, well said. Uncle Dennis says, Hodi Hodi Bila Shaka ni Uncle Deno. Eh, hadi umepiga Hodi. All right. It's okay, the United States of Kerita, UG County. Uh, watching the show, Hadi Tamati and James Bakwana. Pia nengilia kwa mother, huwa inafunza nini kwa society. Aha. Uh -huh. I used to think those questions, uh, I used to ask these questions, producers and actors of films, why programs, ama films nyingi ni za mawaji, kwani kuna other themes. But you will be the first one to watch Fast and Furious. Mm. Mm. But you will no be implement. the first one to watch Akina Jackie Chan <laughs> fighting. You will be the first one. Okay. Patty Lingard says, let her tell to tap it. Ah, ah, nyimku number seven, first of all, just eh. relax. I had a single story. Single story, you know, Zunisha. I mean, the Kwamajira and Nakinasa and Okunaville. Oh, I thought you were an Arsenal fan. I was even going to ask why you're getting confident. To the Wakilisha. To Nakavizuri, could you? Eh! We forgot. Man, you, man, you, man, you. Ah! The issue is lighted up. Eh! As so, we have gone completely off topic, <laughs> as we come back on topic, <laughs> Jay Andrazo says, have seen this post, so let me say I think concerning the matter. Yes, people relate to what they watch. Music is the biggest influence on Kenyan TV, and it has negative effects <coughs> on its consumers who are the young generation. Okay. And I'm guessing this is like in a do-do, sijui, ato kwa mtamu wajewe, zijikula, those ones, etc. Tom Rafiki says, ziko na ukomedi mingi, so huwe zibeba. Hotspot ya wifi, najua, natuka kusema wale, wezi wa bank, wali influenzi, wana money heist. Money! Apo kwa point, apo tumekupatia. Now when you dig tunnel wa kitambo, hiyo ya fika. Hey, yeah. those guys. Wapeni kazi. Kuna movie, eh, kuna, kuna, kuna series. Yeah. Kuna movie ya maseries. <laughs> yeah, kama hiyo, wase wali dig down, wakatokelezia. Ah. Eh? We have never seen such dedication. Six months, unachimba tu kwa. Can you give them employment? <laughs> Maze gava inafaa. Ah, wase wako, wako noma, wako tops. <laughs> And then James says, good morning again, and requesting love by Otile Brown and Ali Kiba. David Neto says, good morning. The content they give their airplay have an impact either directly or indirectly. Okay. I, I, I still feel, and I'm saying this because we have six minutes. I don't know mm -hmm. why time flies when we're having fun. But Fiona, help me understand. Me, Mona, it's a personal opinion. Guy, don't come for me. I think these things are tools. It's like... You know, technology. I can't say a smartphone is evil just because mm -hmm. n mm -hmm. I cannot now tell the government to stop online learning as it was before because of COVID and the schools had been closed. That is simply because Kumpati a gadget. Uh, I, I think these things are tools and, and just the way we choose to handle, yeah. But what, what would you think? I'm going to put the answer on a swallow and answer. I address the nation. <laughs> yeah, regarding um, technology, um, when you are of your mother, can you not find any mind here for like decision to make? It's your own personal choice. It's yet even now quite driven by something. So, when you have a SIM, you make a candle, you have a SIM, you have a SIM, you have a SIM, blah, 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 blah. Mm. At the end of the day, you have a SIM, you have a SIM, and you have a SIM, and you have a SIM, digitalized. Mm. During the COVID, you have a SIM, you have a SIM, internet, laptop, SIM, and what have you. 
So it's a matter of control. Mm-hmm. Una control ama unaeka limits. If you say natumia simu for eh lakini mimi si si control. Lazima iko kile kitu unasema ni kitu pia hata wewe una. I'm talking about the kids. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, parental control. Yes. Yeah. So for the kids like for example um I have a nephew mm-hmm. I call like 7. Mm-hmm. There's a day alikuwa anatumia simu and then you know when they're using the phone for make a year phone. Mm-hmm. So kama kitu uko na watch mtoto uko busy uko busy. Mm-hmm. Hey mama kia anashangaa mtoto anaangalia nini. Ku snoop around. He's watching pornography. 6 years old. 6 years old. And he come across an ad aka aka click. Oh yeah, my so god. Click aka akaanza ku watch. So I made feature and he's a boy. I made feature for corner he's watching what he's watching. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So can you not talk some money if same what you want to me the gadgets and stuff mm-hmm. <laughs> well, for you to mm-hmm. i want like, to hear yeah. like something mm-hmm. that you never yes. see mm-hmm. kama ni pepper pig to join ni pepper pig to watch for you yes. so for the kids ni parental control to they need control there's also there's also if if it's youtube they have the the settings yeah for the kids. for content mm-hmm. so as a parent uko na jukumu la kuhakikisha pia wewe mm. umeka hizo setting because you never know wakati mtoto atachukua simu yako and mm. they don't go searching they just they just happen and then they they find themselves doing that so that's as much as control is input but the gadget pick when a control yeah yes. unaeka the kids mm. option okay now that she's handled our younger audience as in watoto mm. i want to ask you a question I'm and <laughs> you know as a as a proper parent yes. because here you're the parent yes. i want you to imagine your kids are grown Oh joke chef kama miaka zingine unaona ngaa kumzazi hata kuelewi mm-hmm. you don't understanding what mm-hmm. i am going through mm-hmm. in fact you are old school mm-hmm. i don't deserve to come here ha yeah 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 mio to to and yes. it's not your fault it's yes. just basic biology your mm-hmm. brain is still developing your hormones are everywhere and i want to do something that mommy and daddy don't want me to do and it's not at, it's not at your reach mm-hmm. this person is maybe over 16 in the high school I'm in Malaysia Moko Kampo and you know now these are young men mm-hmm. young, yeah, young mm-hmm. ladies yeah mm-hmm. so now how do you approach this na kama talk for chakitu clearly we, we can yeah, more we than can a 6 year old boy eh? yes uh, we are we must be better at mm-hmm. this mm-hmm. so how how do we zoom in and and please make it as brief as possible mm-hmm. uh, let, let's accept one thing first eh? that ka spirit ka rebellion re mm-hmm. being rebellious huwa kana kuja at a certain point hata wewe ukikuwa kuna place ulifika kwa na nao wazai vile tu wamesema wamezidi inabidi ni vile mimi then kilawa sikuwa na kipawa cha kusema i did not have the courage that this generation yes. has to just yeah. speak their mind and say we rada for nini gani ah we, we need to be able to accept that uh, as a parent you can do everything possible mm-hmm. but it's still at the end of the day this kid will be rebellious they will do things that are not worth doing it uh we need to accept our kids as they are mm-hmm. that is from the parental point of view you need to be uh, as they are you shape them don't command them don't uh, general unajua uh, mtoto kuna age yakifika the only thing you can do muongeleshe mm. tell them your point of view irrespective of what they are doing keep on talking to them because i can tell you irrespective of my mother being so harsh and so uh, everything and general and what today i'm i'm a good father mm-hmm. i'm a good husband i'm still a man in in, in process eh? i'm not perfect but some of those things she still in me they are working for me So as a parent do not stop doing what is right when what you think is right. Mm-hmm. The other thing is as a person you need to learn how to venture out in speaking. Mm-hmm. Speak. Find a click that you are able to speak to. Uh, uh you said what you watch and what you read. That is what we are we are looking at. But again, who do you speak to? Who do you conspire to? This this guy's girlfriend probably would have known what could have happened mm-hmm. and could have also spoken out to jamange saidiwa mm-hmm. so when you speak out you are, you have to find someone to be in confiding in this person will be able to help you again this prayer this church there are things you need to associate yourself with god okay so don't ar- run away from the place of god mm-hmm. in your life mm-hmm. 
See now, Pia, you have come with your things and you can tell me you don't believe and you know it's not in my place to force it down your throat. But I do think release is important. Even if you don't believe in a higher power or a deity, you know, Shoriago. So, but just release, release. And what you see on TV, woo, do not try this at home. Do not try this at <laughs> home. Like, can you not copy, copy baby shark? Fine, do that at home. But this is in Guinea. Kill it. Half a second, half a second. <laughs> Reading made me get a wife. Mm -hmm. I was a street boy. Listen. And I got a wife because of reading. We are not part of your story. Don't cry, cry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so very much, guys, for staying with us. This conversation has been very interesting, and I really hope that we can continue it next week because we have more ground to cover. But as it is, at White 54 on Facebook, White 54 channel on Twitter, White 54 underscore channel on Instagram. My name is Valentine, or at Kalamiga, and we think you should have an amazing day.